in vitro fertilization is a process by which we take the eggs out of the female's body and fertilize with the sperms and make it as a good embryo and put it inside the uterus so this was the first process which was invented in 1978 is almost now 42 years since it has been invented and we are mastered the technology but we are not doing ivf for most of our patients we are doing a treatment called icsi so to define who needs ivf ivf is a process where in a dish the eggs are put and then the sperms are left around it for overnight incubation so we are not putting the sperms inside the oocytes so this can be done only when the sperm factor is very good it's normal and the oocytes are also of a best quality why we don't uh, prefer why uh, as a fertility specialist i don't prefer ivf over icsi is that sometimes there is a chance of fertilization failure where when the eggs are being left alone and the next day morning we come and see for our embarrassment no eggs are fertilized or only out of the 10 5 were fertilized then we cannot reinject the sperms and we have to just absorb those five oocytes which has been fertilized this is the only setback of ivf but what is the advantage why still so many fertility centers uh, do ivf is the infrastructure needed for doing ivf is less it is less costlier procedure and no need to have expensive and uh, complicated instruments like uh, icsi manipulator micro manipulator and there is a natural selection of sperms which is happening the embryologist doesn't select the sperm the oocyte itself selects a good sperm so these are the advantages of ivf so if you have a very good normal um, male factor and a female factor definitely you could discuss to your fertility specialist about ivf